Alright, we're gonna have uh, Zeus in the background, it's fine. <laughs> time for YouTube content window, hello! Hello, time to react the... Side Games version of EX Plus, wait no, EX, not EX Plus. Um... Huh? <laughs> Crush your foes with powerful charge attacks! Huh? You got it right by putting Relic Buster, but what? Huh? <laughs> Heat up the poten uh, potency of Colossus powerful charge attack even further beyond by casting Sylph's whatever the thing is called. Don't forget to activate Relic Buster's limit burst to blast the foe with a full burst. Let Ganda Goza take the brunt of the foe's punching punches using the blab blab blab. When the count, when then the counter blows, the dab 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 dab. Huh? <laughs> I mean, I can kind of understand. Why do you want this? <laughs> the fuck? <laughs> the buff are your best friends? Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> Uh, what? <laughs> Whoa, shit! That was fucking loud! <laughs> oh, Monaka has to. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Zeus is even against this bullshit right now, dude. Zeus going, what the fuck is this garbage? Uh, what? UEC support skill 7 anniversary boosts the uh, attack of all allies as a HP falls. Brother! <laughs> Take advantage of that by using a... What? By using a Mafiosa Scorn to power up your party? Cast Tabina's Lidebde to I inflict the bleh 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 status effect and which adds bonus damage based on the number of debuffs inflicted. What? <laughs> Need even more sources on debuffs? Check out Robin Hood's opening shot to Venus the 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 El Monster blah 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 and to dish an extra de <laughs> Dude Dude what <laughs> What the hell is this? <laughs> okay, let me see the grid though. What the hell is this? Wait, is it? Oh, this is from the fucking side story. What the hell is that? Just... Wow. <laughs> Chat, they're asking you to mash Akaram, dude. Damn, dude. Akaram, bro. Rose Queen Bow? What's this? Huh? Oh, this is the side story as well. What the hell is this, man? That's so bad. Why? I mean, they, 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 they kind of got it with this, right? But I wouldn't really suggest that you to just put Lyria, man. <laughs> I don't understand what's with them not wanting to put Lyra in every single one. It's like, okay, we need to like, we need to put like brand new fucking setup every single time Gear Warp comes or some shit. Dude, Lyra is literally like your one-stop best character for OTK. If you have lacking of characters, Lyra is easily dead character, man. <laughs> I do not know why. You can just slot in Lyra and it will work. You can just put Colossus in the last the last slot, just so you can actually get two hundred meters or something. You know? <laughs> Fuck me, man. What the hell? Alright, let me try my OTK. I know my OTK was using 3-chain, but I didn't really like bother switching it up. I could probably go for 2-chain, but uh, I don't know. Waifu team looks very nice. <laughs> uh, yeah, one spear, one stake. That, I don't know why it has an Ixava there either, but yeah, that works, I suppose. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's try. It'd be funny if I actually... Jesus fuck, man! <laughs> Your 
Oh my god, it's really bad now. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my god, it's so bad right now, dude. <laughs> yeah, it was really bright too. It's very close to me right now. <laughs> uh, yeah, YouTube content. <laughs> now you know how bad the, the, the weather can be in my, in my place. <laughs> It's nothing new, really. <laughs> it, this this kind of weather is actually relatively normal during monsoon season. It's actually quite normal. We we get this all the time. <laughs> it's just really based on the positioning of the the, the clouds or whatever. It just so happened that the, the 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 thunder and the lightning and shit is just very close to me. That's why it's really loud right now. Because <laughs> sometimes it can be really really fucking far away. <laughs> <laughs> My OTK is fine. I'm not sure if I really want to switch to to two chains though, but I think that'll be fine for now though. But yeah, either way, I don't think you really need to even fought like you could potentially just do what they actually kinda asked you, like this one. This kinda works, but I don't think you wanna use it like this, like the grid. Cause now is a really good time to farm for like atom and shit, right? Cause Wait, maybe by the time the video comes up, probably not though. <laughs> Because uh, Atom is still up until like 5am Japan time. So you could actually try to farm it. Because it's definitely... It's definitely... Uh, very easy to farm apparently. I got this much within an hour and a half. <laughs> so... Uh, I'm sure you can too. And I already burned quite... As you can see, I have a lot. I have a lot down here. I gotten quite a bit of animas too along the way. So it's uh, definitely doable. I mean, as you can see, this was during my spark. I'm sure you guys already knew. So this... I literally got this like today. <laughs> I just got all these today. I got two fucking ES for some reason. Yeah. But yeah, all these sticks and spears were from the, the, the Atom smashing I fucking... Farmed today. <laughs> yeah. So it's okay. You definitely want at least I mean, if if it's possible, you want to try at least getting one of each, right? But I think the 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 amount you probably want is at least two staffs, because that's usually what a lot of people seems to be doing for like I think when they put in like their standard grid or whatever. But yeah, you can just put in two. But I think for the most part, you want to at least get one each, because you definitely want this. Oops, maybe I should pick the, the upgraded one. You definitely want these, just so you can at least get use of uh, these, make use of this, because this will give you a lot of uh, firepower in your OTK setup. This one definitely help you a lot. Having this is going to be super huge, right? And then this one also helps you a lot, right? And then if you have like a uh, attack awakening as well, it helps too, right? If you have problems with uh, damage consistency and all that. But I'm assuming you should not have... If you have like a relatively decent grid, for example, all right? If you just go back to that stupid uh, template again. All right. If you go back to... Oops. If you go back to this template, right? Just ignore a lot of these weapons. Let's just say you got Opus here. You got Opus here. You got another bat like Xeno or whatever shit. And then you have like at least three sticks or two sticks or whatever. You could put one uh, Atom Spear here. And then you can also put two uh, Atom staffs or like if you have shiva staff that works too or you could also technically if you have extra shiva because you know shiva was read up as well for like almost a week now you could also just put randomly put a sword there for the hell of it if you're lacking in uh sticks for example but yeah you could also yeah if you want you can also just use the akram sure and then like uh baha or or even if you have Astro, you can just slot in Astro too. That's fine. You can just put in all those stuff that you already currently have. You don't really have to follow all this. But I do suggest you to at least get some like Atom shit in there, right? The reason that being this is actually okay is the fact that you get so much out of Relic Buster already. And then if you're using the likes of like Colossus, for example, you already get so much out of him too, right? And then you have other characters like, uh, like Lyria. <laughs> If you have characters like Lyria, it also helps out a lot too, especially if you're 
having problems with uh, getting extra camp because uh, what Lyra actually has, if you well, if you didn't know, is that uh, she has uh, oops, she her S two is really really strong. Yeah, her S two is really really strong. Where the hell is she? Oh, there she is. Her S two is really strong because of this. This is really really strong. So if like. Especially if you have trouble trying to get extra form of damage, having Lyria and you just press her S2 will easily just makes your damage a lot more consistent in a way. It's very very strong. I do not know why they just don't like suggesting her at all. She's a free character. <laughs> a free character that gives you such a really really huge buff, especially if you're one of the weaker side of things when you have not really a completed uh, grid or whatnot. This helps out a lot because you just give you crit and extra cap and extra raw damage. It's really really good. And then obviously if you are looking for other fire uh, OTK characters, yeah, Colossus is one. If you're using the relic, relic Buster Strat, and then you have like the um, what's that? Uh, I'm not sure how is he gonna be for uh, full lumen break shit because this is recorded before the full lumen break happens. I'll probably update that later or something if uh, that happens. But yeah, Elmod is definitely one of them. Elmod is really good OTK as well. And then if you somehow manage to luxury these two characters, they are really good as well. And uh, Siegfried is also really good. Then you also have the uh, what's the the other two twins? Yeah, these two here. This two is actually really good as well. And then also if you uh, if you want to extra actually press some extra buttons and make it even more consistent, technically Subasa is not bad as well because this one is also really really strong. Give your whole party CA specs and shit. And then, uh, yeah, if you know the previous banner, if you really roll, having Michael in your backline helps out a lot in terms of damage consistency. So, uh, yeah, do that. And then also, uh, yeah, uh, Silva, Yukata Silva uh, uh, helps out a lot too. So, yeah, you can just do all that as an example. Yeah. But yeah, trust me, Lyra is actually really fucking good. Just, just use that. <laughs> you know? And then if you're using the Relic Buster shit, you I'm pretty certain you can actually get the the not not just EX. This is EX, but like yeah, you're pretty sure you can get EX plus down really re relatively easy too. You, you don't have to go to this extent. This extent can go fucking <laughs> This is dumb. This is this is what I call fucking dumb. You don't want to spend fucking two minutes click 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 until then only you kill one. <laughs> You, it, meat farming has always been you want to spend very minimal buttons as possible because you have to repeat these hundreds and hundreds of times you know especially if you want to like try to rank right you need to spend a lot of time farming meat so in, in order for you to do that you want to spend as little time as possible per raid right <laughs> that's why so like maybe at most you want you 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 will probably will at least spend there maybe 20 seconds or 30 seconds at most if you use this kind of setup right this stupid thing here your minimum gonna spend at least one to two minutes just to finish clicking all that shit <laughs> it's too damn slow <laughs> but uh either way i think that's uh that's honestly the the quick suggestion i can give you at a moment i wouldn't really say fire is really easy to get otk done though Fire is actually one of the, I would say one of the harder ones to actually set up OTK teams. You know? In comparison to say like wind, uh, light, dark, or even uh, water. You know those ones are actually earth, yeah. Those ones are really fucking easy to set up compared to fire. Fire is like definitely one of the harder ones just because, you know. Fire technically just got attention recently, so. <laughs> it's quite clear, right? <laughs> To see how uh to see how they are right at the moment, but uh, I think that's all I'm going to uh, suggest at the moment. Yeah, just just don't just don't do this. This is this is a bad idea. <laughs> yeah, this one's okay, but man, why the hell? <laughs> they they were so close to making it good, man. So close. <laughs>